All right, everybody, Andy Miller here again, talking about how I use the FlightScope X3 launch monitor with my students to help them play better golf. So here's a shot that I hit. Okay, I'm hitting a seven iron, and I'm gonna go through what a lesson would look like if I'm trying to get somebody to get a little bit more distance out of their irons, uh, hit their irons a little bit farther. So my seven iron has about 30 degrees of loft. So one of the numbers I display when I'm working on this particular thing with people is dynamic loft. Okay, so the best players in the world, when they make contact with an iron, they're taking some loft off. So like I said, my seven iron has 30. On this particular shot, I had 23. Uh, another one I put up here is height because sometimes you can get some decreased loft, but that happens because you hit the ball low on the face. So we want to make sure that we hit it in the center of the club and take some loft off. And uh, two other numbers that I have up here, angle of attack. Minus 4.7, that means I made contact with the ball as my club was traveling downward, which is very important when we're hitting an iron shot off the ground. Low point, where is the bottom of my swing? With an iron, we want the bottom of that curve on the target side of the ball. So again, there's many ways that using this information can help people play better. It's really difficult to see some of these things with the naked eye, which is why we have this technology here.